Hawaii could soon see between one and four billion dollars in federal relief money in a compromise bill that's finally coming close to a deal after months of disagreement in Congress. And the money could help stave off teacher furloughs. Gina Mangieri reports. With CARES Act money and other federal relief running dry this month, a Hail Mary at the nation's capital might come together this week. It'll be uh, somewhere between $750 billion and $900 uh, billion uh, nationwide, which will mean that Hawaii will see somewhere between uh, one and four billion dollars of additional uh, relief. Relief in some critical areas that helped Hawaii's families and small businesses tread water through a treacherous 2020. We want to extend the PPP program, the small business program. Uh, we want to extend unemployment insurance. Um, in the proposed compromise, there's also a lot of money for vaccine distribution um, and rent relief, not just forbearance like in the previous legislation, but actual cash uh, for people to pay the rent and money for uh, lower education, K-12, through and higher education. A broader deal for state and local government funds may be carved out for later negotiation, but I asked would the education money in the compromise relief bill be able to stave off Hawaii's public school furloughs? The current draft of the bill allows the money for lower education to be used to pay teacher salaries. So it'll certainly help in terms of the DOE's fiscal situation and should help them to avoid, you know, these worst case scenarios that we're really looking at as early as next month. It's not yet known if another round of direct stimulus checks to families will make the final cut. The current draft does resolve a big small business worry whether expenses offset by PPP grants will be allowed to be tax deductible. The current draft has that issue resolved and fixed. Um, so um, we would have full deductibility. Um, so th that issue looks to be solved, again, as long as we pass a bill. And passing the bill is still the tough part. All summer and fall, lawmakers in Washington have said they know Americans need more relief, yet no deal's been sealed. We now have agreement between uh, Mitch McConnell and Nancy Pelosi and Chuck Schumer, Democrats and Republicans on the House and Senate side, that we simply must pass a compromise bill. Gina Mangieri, K2N2 News, working for Hawaii.